Hello Internet, Internet. Big Dave here, and I am cheap. Sure. Hello Internet, it's Big Dave here, and I am drunk. Which is probably the only reason that I'm playing Mudlarks, which is an 800 by 600 point-and-click game that I found for free on Desura. I don't know. Yeah. My judgment is not all that great right now. But let's take a, uh, take a dip in. Look, if you made Mudlarks and you're watching this, I don't mean any insult to you if I shit on your game. Uh, I've had a few drinks and I am sitting here all night tonight and playing games that just catch my fancy. And if nothing else, Mudlarks caught my eye. So let's take a deeper look into it and see exactly what this thing is all about. Mudlark, a noun, a person who scavenges in river mud for objects of value. All right, sure, that's a thing. Oh my god, what have I gotten myself into? Okay, London, UK, and we have some pretty sweet I real-life graphics. It's not FMV, but these are, in fact, peep. Oh, he's walking towards the screen. Oh my god, okay. Yeah. I guess these guys must be mudlarks. They're they're digging in river mud. Oh, alright, well they're English, so uh Found anything decent, Vincent? Not really. A lot of stims, but nothing patterned. I found a, re a reasonable clay pipe bowl. Cool, man. This weather is getting atrocious, though. Yeah, I think we should probably head to the pub soon. My hands are freezing. And off he goes. Off he goes. This is... I'm actually kind of interested in this. I mean, it's so out there. Uh, for centuries, people have been... Ha people have been coming here to the banks of the River Thames to try their luck at uncovering treasures... From the mud and the filth. These people like us mudlarkers, as we are known, have found all sorts of things down here. From valuable jewels to suits of armor, statues of Roman deities, and other such wonders. But these days, pickings are few and far between. I'm more likely to prick my finger on a hypodermic needle than uncover a musket. It has been another fun day of mudlarking, but we've only got a few broken clay pipes to show for it. Oh well. The wind is really starting to pick up. We should probably think of heading off now. There is a cold bite to the air, and the tide will be rising soon. Indeed. To the pub! Uh, would we like a tutorial? Uh, no. That's, no. Let's just not tutorial at all. It's a point and click, so I, I point and I click and he goes. All right, there's our friend. That's Vincent, right? We are Winston. Winston and Vincent. Okay, sure. Should we interact with our pal here? Nothing? No, just... That's my friend Vincent, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, I see. So you can click through with the right mouse button. Uh, it's getting pretty cold out here. I forgot what voice I was using for. <laughs> yeah, I think we should probably head back now. Whoa, behind you. Did you see that? Shooting star? Well, it's spaced out there for a second. Damn, I missed it. It was pretty quick. It's completely light outside. <laughs> Anyway, it's a shame we didn't find anything monumental today. This is the accent is just going to change throughout the video. One day, Winnie, one day, 
We'll find something big. He's, he calls him Winnie. Alright. I know it. Fingers crossed. Nice Roman jug, perhaps? Wouldn't that be grand? Maybe even worth a few grand, eh? Okay, let's go to the pub. Just a tick. Taking it all in. Alright. He just wants to stand there and stare out, out at the river. Okay, sure, sure. Alright, where are we headed? I guess we're headed to the pub. I'll take a drink of my beverage while that happens there. Come on, Slowpoke. Meet you at the pub. This is this is just getting worse and worse. I I humbly and solemnly solemnly uh, truthfully and completely apologize to any person of English descent who is watching this. I am doing your great people a disservice with my mockery. But I shall continue. What a view. I don't think that's actually an English accent. That's more like a Scottish accent, wouldn't you say? Okay, I, I don't control this guy, but he is walking. And off to the pub. So I, I honestly have to say, this is kind of a novel way to approach a game like this. I mean, you know, the, the cutouts of real people, the real backdrops. I mean, it's, it's kind of interesting. Hmm. What was that? Oh my goodness, he's found something. A locket of some type. Wait for me! He says as he scurries off. Mudlarks. Oh, dramatic music. Oh! Mr. David Bowie. David Bowie. Oh, with the eye patch. God, okay. Okay, so this is a lady speaking. I think I already used my British lady voice on this guy here. Well, my love, I better be going to work, I suppose. What are you going to do today? <laughs> Alright, I'm going to change this guy's voice. Uh... Oh, I think I might call Vincent and ask if he wants to go mudlarking again. You only went a couple of days ago. I know, but he really found something last time. What did he find? All you guys seem to find with those shape broken pipes. You mean historical, fascinating, incredible clay pipes? Oh, of course. All I can say is, if Vincent had a girlfriend to give it to... She would be a happy lass indeed. Why? It's a piece of jewellery, a locket. From what I briefly saw of it, it seems to be made of gold and looks very old. Why can't you ever find anything like that for me? A nice brooch or something? But look at all the beautiful clay pipes and ceramics I have found for you. Yes, my love. They're great. But yes, he also found actual jewellery. I'm butchering Terry Gilliam's fabulous English lady voice. That's incredible. It's amazing. Sorry, I really have to be going now. Jerry will be on my case if I'm late. Okay. I've left your muffin on the table. Enjoy your leisurely day. This is the tension between this couple is just palpable. Enjoy your leisurely day, you slug who is not working and digging through mud all day. Oh, nice. Thanks. Oh, wish I had a week off work too. Okay, he's got a week off, so he's he's okay. My my faith in this character has been redeemed. Winnie's not an asshole after all. See you tonight. Have a good day. You too. See you later. I might take this muffin before I forget. Blueberry, not my favourite. I'll have it later. What I really want is a full English. I don't know what that is. What better way to start my holiday than a newspaper and a greasy fried breakfast? 
I'll give Vincent a call, and when I'm there, I wouldn't mind another mudlarking session today if I need to go... And I need to go hear more about his locket. I can't believe one of us actually found something that could be genuinely valuable down there. All right, I'm starting to lose it here. I think that is about all we need to see of mudlarking, and I think you would probably agree. All right, I've been Big Dave. This is mudlarking. You can pick it up right now for free on Desura. It was part of their free Friday. I can't say that it's going to be free forever, but it's free right now. Somebody answer that damn phone. Also, I have been your a drunk host of this look at mudlarking. I actually think that this game isn't too bad at all. It's a very novel concept. I really like it, and I uh, can't hate anybody who likes David Bowie. All right, guys, I have been Big Dave, and until next time, take it easy.